Five must know things about Class B airspace. She's a bad with a fresh BBL who can make it clap, 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 clap. Bravo! Bing bong! Class badass! Lego! Numero uno! Class B airspace surrounds some of the busiest airports. It can go up to 10,000 feet MSL or higher. There are no universal dimensions to Class B airspace. So always go by what's depicted on your sectional chart for the particular area that you're looking for. It's going to tell you exactly what you need to know about that Class B airspace within your area or the destination that you're flying to on your flight plan. Boom! Numero dos! It is depicted on your sectional chart by a group of solid blue lines. When that thing is solid and it's blue and it's sitting pretty, it's Class B, baby. It's busy. B for busy, B for badass, B for BBL. Give it a round of applause. Why? Because it's Bravo A one time. Number of the race, pop quiz. Can a student pilot fly solo inside a Class B airspace? Flying, floating that thing, looking at them BBLs inside a Class B. Can it be done? The answer is no. Yes, it can be done, but only with special training and an endorsement from your instructor. So it's very critical that you have all those things in place before you can experience class B solo as a student pilot. So technically it is possible, but more than likely you probably won't fly into class B solo as a student pilot. Way too much going on and your instructor may not want to lean that way with you and maybe want you to focus in on the basics first before you allow to go that path and go that route. So know that it is possible, but you must have proper training and you must have the proper endorsements to do so to get clear into that class B airspace. Numero cuatro, you need of course the usual mode C transponder and you need a two-way radio baby because communication is going to be key because you want to hear some critical words, words that are going to be music to your ears. You want to hear your tail number being acknowledged and the fact that you have been clear in the class B airspace. When you hear that, it's like the most beautiful thing you can hear in the world and you float that thing in the class B airspace airspace until you've been acknowledged in that way and until you've been cleared in the class b airspace do not under any circumstances enter class bravo until you hear those infamous words and then you enter that bbl and you make a clap 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 a and these are five must know things about class b airspace if you have a funny class bravo story hit the comment section down below i want to hear from you i am donovan batiste don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel this is Leadership Mindset. Subscribe to this channel for more pilot talk. Hey, Class B, Class Big Dog.